This ain't your father's beer anymore. Craft breweries are popping up across the map, introducing a complexity and sophistication to a market that is benefiting from growing up. So when you sit down with a, a beer that you've never had before, you can actually pick it apart piece by piece, by ingredient, by region, by style. Um, and the people that are starting to do that are starting to enjoy the beer a lot more. Boston Beer Works in Fenway is one of the places that welcomes creativity. Really, blueberry and watermelon, they go hand in hand. Um, you know, we pretty much have, like right now we have on the pumpkin, so that's selling just as well as the, the blueberry. Not every idea is a keeper, however, as mistakes have been made. Some ingredients just don't make for a good beer. When Bud Light Lime came out, we decided to do a light beer with lime. That one came out pretty bad. It, they added lime extract and lime juice and lime some, it's just lime overkill. Yet even these creative mistakes help devotees refine their palates. Just the way that, you know, a wine drinker would pick apart a wine from a certain region or a certain year or whatnot. Um, you're able to do that with beer now, you know, aging processes, hops, malts, yeasts. It's all relevant. As options for creativity and complexity continue to evolve, the craft beer industry stands poised to explode. With businesses like Boston Beer Works involved, the industry certainly has fantastic caretakers. Can beer catch up to wine as the new sophisticated drink of the 21st century? I certainly intend to find out. For BUTV, this is Alexander Hyacinth signing off.